All right, gang. We are gonna do Bleak Falls. We are on the back half here on the White Run side, wearing my Zealot robes and Imperial boots, Dalmar gloves, and my leather helmet of Magicka. Um, we're just coming through. They avoid him like the plague. We haven't eaten any food yet. I'm gonna pop a mammoth cheese. Having faster regen, I think, is gonna benefit us pretty well. Also, I've got that frost astronaut staff on hotkey because uh, shit gets hairy. I know a frost astronaut can't do a whole lot to a Draugr, but it's a it's a line of defense. That's my thought process here. The guy's quick, which means he's also strong. You'll be so much easier to roll when you're dead. Ah! <laughs> uh! I gotta save a few bolts for the Draugr section, because you know how I already do it. <laughs> you saw the last video. If you saw the last video, you know how I do it. I, uh, use the, um, crossbow to bring bandits, or not bandits, Draugr to me. Come on, scumbag. To die. Oh no, the ones over here hurt me. We need to go back down. Sweet, now we're gonna have a ton of fucking bandits on our case. Yep, there they are. It's the tower bandits. I'll kill you if I have to. I don't have as much range with this thing. I think it's all the tower bandits. I can't even remember what music is bass Skyrim and what is add-on music. Because I like the song. Did I already rob you? Yeah. Someone still knows where I'm at. up here? No. I hear someone screaming far away. So yeah, if I use certain gear, I can throw up uh, transmute muscles, which is nice. the person who wants me dead. Anyway, 
Uh, I'll probably cut away a big chunk of this. That or I'll cut to right here, but... Uh... When are we gonna get a summon, or a summon slaughterfish spell, you know? <laughs> I can't stop thinking about it. Give me a summonable slaughterfish. You can give it legs, I don't care. It could be a land slaughterfish. Also, I need more slowed lore. I was watching this big old video on slows. Maybe want to do a necromancer build really bad, so maybe we'll do that next. Whenever uh, Jazeel here perishes. Come on. Don't swing at me, fuckhead. Come on. Mama ain't gonna hurt you. That's right. God, this wreck sucks. Let's see what you've got. You're a little too turtly for my favor. You know what? I should probably grab that enemy friendly fire plug. -in. I might do that like right after this fight because I can't save during combat. Or should you? Because I'm not gonna be a cornball. God, that was a trial. No, we're taking his iron sword. I know I can use one of those pretty well. And I think the Lunar War Axe will put in a chest near the front of Bleak Falls. That way, if it ends up being a slog and I'm there all night and it gets to be dark and I can use the enchantment, then uh, we'll go from there. You don't have what it takes to kill me. To oblivion with you. God damn, the iron sword sucks. Uh, we'll take that to sell it later. Let's go check the chest really quick. Okay, I think we're ready. And, like, before we came this way, I bought a fuck ton of those, uh, lantern oils, so hopefully we won't lose all of our oils mid-fight like last time, because I do not have candlelight this time around. But I do have some torches saved up. So we're just supposed to sleep here when Arvid runs off with that little bit of That dark elf wants to go on ahead and let him. Better than us, risking our pets. She's high level. I love a good fight. I'm gonna wear that tail as a belt. <laughs> Woo! That didn't feel good. How are we doing on stamp potions? Ooh, not well. I'll never get tired of killing these bastards. Carlos <laughs> smite you. You'll need to do better than okay. that. <laughs> You're a fool to test me. Last mistake. Gonna rip you open! Your kind has no place here! It's nothing. Come on. I think he's about maybe out of stamina. There we I'll go. Mount your head on my wall. Just give him to fuck himself up. One more. Where you? Mountain flower. I'll 
kill you! Victory is yours! I submit! Such a risky move, but it uh, ends up being worth it, I would say. Oh, we have plenty of healing potions. I uh, have an amulet of Mara on at the moment for the restoration benefit. <clears throat> so we can keep uh, our buffs up. Those are some good items right there. Let's get rid of the iron sword. If I can find it. There it is. Oh no, did they finally take that away? Well, how much money do we have? Not much. Alright, well, looks like we gotta go scrounge for an iron sword. I guess we'll kill at least the bandits that are in here. Take our lunar axe and put it back on. I should have thought about that. Cool. So we'll kill the bandits here, scrounge up some money, and then we'll go buy the silver sword from somebody. I should have thought about it. It's my bad. Over here. flower. Alright, that gave him some good damage. Let's see what you've got. Can't wait to count out your coin. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Me. Last mistake. Oh. I almost died doing it, but that zealot reflect is saving my ass time and time again. Alright, so I think the silver sword is around eleven hundred dollars. I have that amulet of Xanathar. Um, so like I said, we're just gonna go kill some shit, grab some loot, I'll run back to White Run. It's a waste of our buffs. But it's gotta be done. It'll probably take about an in-game hour. Hopefully not. Maybe like 20 minutes. I don't know. I don't know how much how, I don't know how long it's actually gonna take. There's someone there. We're gonna throw our scaled armor game. back on. <laughs> Fucking Jesus, man. Alright, well that was a lot of my resources. Take those bolts, I'll tell you that. Cool. that for selling. Nothing of use. Just taking all the shit to sell it off. <laughs> well, he's doing, going back to get the silver sword will, uh, Make it later at night for us so we can actually use this war axe. I let my stamina go down. I'm a dipshit. Okay, cool. Let's 
So let's go hit this chest over here. And then uh, we'll kind of decide if we want to hit the spider first later. Cool. Holy shit. Holy shit. Cool. We'll probably sell this soul jam though. I just need to be able to barely afford the shit I need before I let you actually. So in, in, in Dungeons Revisited, there's this uh, area here that's got some uh, dead bandits, and those should have some gold on them. So let's go grab that. There's also this door, but I think it's locked. No, it's open. Is there anything of use down this way? Never really explored this section. I think it just leads to a locked door, though. Shit, yeah. Well, I'm gonna go grab the uh, shit. I'll head to White Run and come back. All right, gang, we got it. But uh, at what cost, you know? Because uh, I had to sell so much shit to get the silver sword. Come on, chump. Now he did a little damage to himself. Um, I had to sell all of my backup soul gems and then uh, my Orca sword over absorption. So we, we really had to get rid of a lot of our good shit for this. Um, also, on a side profile I'm playing, a non-permadeath run with three tweaks, I'm here with a battle mage right now in the same spot, Bleak Falls, and uh, they're still getting one shot in heavy armor by the Draugr. So I'm a little hesitant. If I can't kill these first three very quickly, we're going to go back to just fight other shit, because I was looking at some of the other homies' permadeath runs, and they're doing this place at a much higher level. Uh, we're with better shit. So now I kind of feel like a dingus. And I went back and looked at Durza's playthrough, and we barely made it out of here. There was definitely some moments where Durza should have died. Swing, dude. Oh, and as an audio note to myself, to tell the Three Tweaks Discord, for these robes, for the Zealot robes, for the reflect value, instead of just lowering it like we talked about, we could just bring it back up to a thousand. And then, uh, what we could do is attach a random, I don't even know if it's possible, but the same condition that Bouncer has, it's a random percent chance. Um, I think the condition is like get random percent above whatever value you assign. So you can make it like a 90% or a 10% chance, you know? Something along those lines. You, over here. So we're, we're going to see how this first Draugr fight goes. If it's bad, we're not going to continue. We're going to go somewhere else. Because I really, really want to see how we do with the higher tier shit. With the, the good magic regen. Alright, do I have my good necklace on? I do. Okay. So I threw mammoth cheese, or uh, yeah, mammoth cheese for the regen. The whole, I don't even know if I talked about it in the last clip. The whole reason I wanted to come here is because I bought Sunfire finally. Um, we're gonna take the that, and then yeah, we were gone so long selling shit and getting the money for the sword that my uh, tonic and bomb are almost empty, which is not fun. Okay, let's see how much it takes here. That's not a lot of damage. And I know if I get hit, I'm gonna die. My heavy armor guy was getting fucked up. Jazeel is gonna get fucked up. God damn it, I can't play it that fast and lose. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. We're gonna kill these guys and we're gonna fuck off. That's if we kill these guys without dying. That's okay damage from Sunfire. Go 
go to my hiding spot here. Oh shit, yeah, I don't want to go much further. You know what? No, I'm not going to do it. I know I'm being a coward, but I, I, fuck it, I want to live. I want to live. <laughs> I really want to see what it is when our Mara effects get all maxed out. We're eight dungeons away from the next one, so we'll keep doing bandits and some easier low tier content, because I keep almost dying doing that, so. We're not, we're not immortal yet. <laughs> I just want to be a little stronger. We'll come back around level 15, level 20. Maybe sooner if I can get my uh, stats up higher, but uh, I'm going to go to the next spot while we still have buffs, and we'll keep on trucking. All right, gang, so we're back at the uh, camp in Falkreath. We dumped off all our shit back in Yorvasker. And the goal right now is just to get strong enough to actually take on Bleak Falls. Um, gear it up. And we're going to Bile Gulch. I think we're strong enough to take that on now. Alright. Oh, yep, he already saw us. He's got a crossbow. Alright, he should run down and open this door. I hope. Yep. Okay. Oh shit! There she is. All right, that's uh, that's Graza, a uh, unique shield mage. She gets the staff, she gets the sword, she gets the shield. She's got robes. She's got the heavy armor, gauntlets, and boots. Trying to be careful because uh, when I was testing this on my vanilla profile, the orc somehow got up here, like into this little crevice, and jumped down on me. All right. We just got to clear this. There she is, right there. You can see. Got her. So she's got. Uh, some restoration ability and some uh, alteration ability. She'll keep her mage armor up pretty reliably. I just gotta get these schmucks to come down. They almost never come down for some reason. There we go. You'll be so much easier to rock if you're dead. Come on, chump. Oh, and I uh, I threw on that. Uh, Plug-in from uh, Power of Three. Enemy friendly fire. I saw that Arcade's commandment has it, so I'm like, you know what? I'll give it a shot. Oh shit, we're not using food. Shit. Uh, tomato. Alright, let's go with our robes. <laughs> it's such a risky move still. I think at the higher levels it'll be kind of, you know, easier to pop that off. the other big one. You puny weak. Come on. All right, there she is, bitchin'. There's the other orc. I'll there he is. Oh, real shit. Fight. And come in and fight me, chump. Sometimes they'll come down automatically, and other times they, they're really pussyfoot. Again. You're a fool to fight me. Whoa, that was weird. I like stopped blocking and then he got hurt. So if it's reflecting damage done, I think depending on your setup, if it is having trouble telling when you're blocking, like how am I what am I trying to say here? Shit. Um, 
Sorry, I need to get out of the way. So if you're blocking and you let go and they hit you in that same moment, I think you still have the perk active. It still counts as you blocking if it's immediately after. How is she shooting? Oh, she's got me through the little divot there. I didn't even realize that hole was there. So yeah, I don't know. I think making it a random percent chance may be the way to go. So like, the condition should be is blocking and then get random percent like a, you know, greater than 10 or even 5, make it a 5% like, you know, chance. Alright, come on. It's fucking tango. Oh, I need to scoop her up this way. She'll murder me on these steps. For blood, for glory. Gonna rip you open. She tends to back up after he's, she swings, which is. I like it, because it provides her some protection. Your death brings me honor. Alright, we need to pop some potions. Pray to your gods for mercy. I never I don't think I took my tonic in my bomb. Where's my tonic? Where's my tonic? Where's my tonic? My weapon too heavy. You have a death wish. All right, we're gonna go zealot to try and block her out. Time to die, hero. Beg for your miserable life. Yeah. Hit me. Come on. I'll have your head. Pray Hit me. to God for mercy. Come on, one more good swing. I'll kill you. Ah! Okay, thank God. So I might give her some more sword perks. She does a little more damage because in her current state she's a little weak. I'm not gonna take the staff because it's something from something I'm making, so it feels a little cheap. Boots. Okay. Sick. All right, so there's there's the boss in here, and surprise, surprise, I have one more NPC in here. <laughs> so you can't go downstairs and rob all that or a calcum either. There's the boss here, like normal. So if you want to fight him and get the chest, you can. But in order to, uh, oh shit. I'll show you what a real. In order to get uh, the Orcalcum in the basement, you gotta go down there. Oh, shit. That was dumb of me. Let's heal real quick here. Alright, come on, chump. Come on. Someone's gonna get hurt. You. I need some more room. This what you want. All right, you know what? Let's give it a try. Come on, hit me. Give up when you still can. Oh God, it fucking hurts. Okay. Yeah, I think that uh, a random percent chance would be better than just a flat damage for blocking. I really need to make a heavy armor character. But yeah, the, the Zealot Robes, uh, even if it didn't have the shield reflect thing, and it was just the health regen and the lower armor rating, I'd still be all about it. Alright. 
doesn't notice us yet. And that's the thing. Where he's at in the basement, I made it so that you can rob this chest if that's what you want. And in order, you get a little bit of free aura calcum. Maybe I'll bring him up closer. I don't know. Either way, let's spend these insights. All right, let's get his ass. Crack the crusher. He's fast on his feet. He swings fat. He's just all around a tank. I do not want to take him. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Um, he has a couple tricks up his sleeves, like, uh... Besides, you know, having... Oh, fuck. No, don't do it, don't do it. No. <laughs> he gets scrolls. He won't always spawn with that uh, Orcish Battle Axe. He's got a compact level list. So he, he can spawn with a couple different items. Why am I not drawing my weapon? There we go. That was dangerous to me. I'm trying to get Grack to hit my shield. There we go. Alright, I gotta stop with the shield thing for now. Because the only reason he's so low on health is because I fucking reflected the damage. There we go. Alright, cool. Thanks for the battle, Greg. He can spawn with a couple different things, like... He, there's a whole list of rings he can have. I'm just going to take the money. That and that. He can spawn ingots, scrolls, a couple different kinds of battle axes that would come with different tempering ratings. It's a good orcish battle axe. Cool. There we go. Oh, fuck. Do it. We do gotta collect Beastial Stew ingredients. We're gonna run out here soon. Uh, this place has a couple good ranged bandits, so we're gonna throw on one of our Fortify healths. Mike, get out of here, man. Yeah, there's the... Fuck, two, three. I count how many hits it takes me to get rid of certain enemies. Come on. Come on. There we go. Bring it on, chump. Come on. You gotta remember to use this more often. Oh, god damn it, didn't get the shield up quick enough. Come on, chump. Come on, chump. We're getting pretty good at bandit content, which sucks because we're at that weird spot where we can't really take on Draugr, but bandits aren't really an issue anymore. I'm still going to make a super cut here of us just doing bandit content until either I'm ready for Draugr or I die. Holy shit. All right, we're going to switch up to our good necklace of dwindling magic. Uh, the dungeon pack's coming along nicely for those of you that give a shit. Uh... I got a really cool one. I changed up the way I do it. I choose an exterior cell for a entry point first, and then from there, I decide that's a firebolt. Okay. Dude, that was a good combo. Oh, I didn't get my fucking shield up quick enough. There is a bandit camp up north this way, but it's got a fucking, uh, it's always got a mage at it. Oh, sweet. Thanks, Mr. Wolf. Come on, chump. It was getting intense. I don't want to go too close to the, uh... Fucking Forsworn. Alright, one at a time, chumps. Let's do this shit. Bring it right the fuck on. I'm all amped up. I'm all fucked up. Come on. Jazzy was all fucked up on Mountain Dew. I'm ready to beat Bandit ass. Oh, no I'm not. Not if it's a mage. 
Can I, can I wiggle back up this way? Oh man, we gotta like hit that guy quick. Did that poison myself? No. We need the mage to show up so I can beat his ass with a few power attacks. I gotta also remember that my shield can be useful for... Dindling shock. That the best you can do. All right, go. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Holy shit! All right, I made a mistake. All right, stamina first. Oh god. Maybe I'm not ready to kick bandit ass. All right, hold on. We can regen our shit up here. Oh wait, no, we can't. All right, we're gonna go up there. There's a dead wolf. There's some rocks. All right, maybe I wasn't as ready for bandit ass kicking as I thought. Please don't kill me. Is the boss stuck? The boss tends to get stuck in this corner. All right, we're good. There's also an animal spawn out this way. Looks like we're in the clear. Okay. One at a time. You're almost dead. I know that. Come on. There we go. There's that one down. Die. I swear I'll die already so I can take your stuff. You won't live to see tomorrow. What it takes to kill me. No more. I can take you. This is the end for you. I'm out of stam potions. I gotta be careful. Uh, purple. There's our mage. So am I gonna kill that wolf? You won't live to see tomorrow. My mouse is fucking up. Should have seen that coming. I'm not good at managing toxicity. I know that for a fact. Okay, run. Run, 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 run. I'm just trying not to lose track of the corpses because I really want to loot everything. Alright, back in a good spot. nothing. that it? That's your best? Time to... Finish this. Come on, chumps. Oh, fuck, my keyboard's fucking up. I don't want to back out like a baby. There we go. Victory is yours. I submit. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Come on over here. It's nothing. No. Not like this. You won't live to. There we go. Victory is yours. I submit. That's the boss. All right, we did it, gang. I'll film me looting. Only if I find something cool will I actually show you, though. Okay. We're here. Uh, I think Jazeel's at the point where when she sees a bandit, she just shoots. We're not fucking around. She goes a scummy ass bandit when she sees it. Dance in place, dance in place, dance in place. I don't want to get too close. I want to keep some distance between us. Alright, that guy's almost dead. Uh, 
Oh, shit. Try to keep our distance. Um, ice. We're one down so far. All right, give me one second here. Sorry, I had to turn the mic off real quick. I'm trying to get better at not polluting the airways with my bullshit. Dance in place, dance in place, dance in place. Oh, that didn't work. Not at all. So ranged bandits are still our bane. We're getting better at it. Oh. She wants to chase me down. All right, you want to play that way? She wants to play that way. God, she's vicious for level three. That's what you get. Good God. All right. All right, we'll stick with it. So there's a lady here by the name of... Uh, you know what? I already forget the bandit's name. I have a special bandit here. All right, there's another one that fights the dust. Who's the other range one? I hear somebody popping off on us. All right, cool. Let's take out the guy around the corner first, because I want to run this way for cover. Let's we take on the next stage. Can't win this. <laughs> <Fight Mercer! laughs> trying to get better at fighting in third person when I need to. Not too good at it right now. It's loaded. No, it is not. Uh, Steel Shock. Alright, I've got one of my bandits for my mod here. Uh, she is not to be trifled with. She wasn't one for purpose, she was one for just fun. She doesn't really serve a purpose here besides just being an addition. Here, wolf. Draw the eyes out of you, fool. It's fucking rage bandits, man. That's probably her. So she has a crossbow, and then she dual wields mace and dagger. She's dangerous. Sick. Do I have the space for that? We do now. Alright, cool. Uh, we'll put the ice one on three. Alright, we got some staffs now, baby. Alright, since there's no more mages left... Oh, I'm not even worried. That's why I'm taking an extra damage. Alright, enhanced constitution back up. Yes. There's somebody up here. Oh, there he is. Oh shit, these fucking Dunmer and their wards. Either anyway, what I was gonna say is there's a red guard here and she's dangerous. <laughs> Between all the three tweaks buffs and uh, everything else, she's formidable. If you get caught in that dual-wield range, you're fucking dead. Where's she at? 
There's the boss in there. They got a crossbow. Alusana, there you are. She's quick. Ooh, shit. Yeah, she hits like a fucking truck. She's all perked out. Plenty of health. And with that steel battle axe and fiery souls being here, it actually makes a little more sense. In the Three Tweaks version, at least. I don't know if I actually need to make an exact different version for Three Tweaks users. I probably won't. Maybe I will. Maybe if it needs it. Shit. Oh, I forgot the cave's right there. She's got heavy armor on, and then her gauntlets and boots are just the normal uh, banded equip sets. So they can be light, heavy, what, what have you. I didn't want to make her two god mode, because with her dual wielding, she's dangerous. Going to enjoy killing you. Okay. She's stuck. That's my fault. Rigo and Alusana. Alusana and Asur. Oh, there goes the potion. Fuck. I'm just trying not to get caught in that dual wield range. She's deadly. Oh, thank God. Okay. I've had her end some permadeath runs for my non three tweaks runs, but yeah. She needs some different bolts. She doesn't have the updated bolts, so I do gotta fix that regard, but. Besides that, she's she's just fun. Extra level of danger here. And if, like as usual, if anyone has any suggestions, let me know. Think of a place that you want to bandit, let me know. If you think of a place you want a necromancer, fuck it, let me know. I'll throw one down. Alright, there's the boss. Yeah, she's got the she's got the good shit in there. All right, I think I'm more comfortable now. Whoa! We're wasting all our poison potions on this lady. That's all you got. Why didn't you have a dagger? We'll take the helmet. Oh shit, we don't have the room. Alright, cool. Is there a chest here? Am I mistaken? There's a book. That's what it was. And then a dead necromancer. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Yeah, no chest. That's what it was. Dead necro. Holy fucking shit. Oh my god. Alright, well, there goes the Staff of Sparks. Wait, no. Get rid of the Staff of Sparks. Pick up the Staff of Flame Atronaut. What the fuck? That's cool. Holy shit, gang. Well, we don't deserve it, but we got it. Yep, yeah, there we go. And then we're gonna throw that bitch on hotkey. We should need to start chanting so we can fucking start getting these things up and going. 